Okay, so when I'm when I'm testing the screen, I've, this is your original screen cable. This is the customer's original screen cable. There is no backlight, so you can only see novel but nothing else. And I've taken this screen cable from another laptop, and if I put it in, uh, I'm getting pretty much the same result. Just make sure I'm not shorting anything. Uh, and let me plug in the charger. Okay, I'm gonna plug in the charger now. Okay. Okay, now it's on. You can look at the screen. Uh, you can only tell when it, the moment it powers one actually when it says the novel. I'm gonna try it again. Okay, it's just dim. But you can see the white LED flashing. So the laptop is on and it's working. Anyways, checking the fuses. Uh, we've got a fuse right over here. Right over there, fuse 3. In continuity mode, we'll check this fuse. It's working fine. So this, this fuse is fine, but this is not our, this is not the side that goes to the back light. So you can see when it, when you follow it, when you try to follow it, it's coming like to, to this end. It's not even connected to the last pin. And if you check this other end, So yeah, that's what I was talking about. You can see it's not even, it's connected to only one pin. But usually the backlight will be connected to two or three pins. So you can see there you've got one, two pins, and you've got a big capacitor there. And that's your backlight circuit. You've got ground this side, the side is positive. She's got like 60 kilo ohms. So this is fine. But then I try to follow it back. I can't see where it's going. There's no fuse over there. It's going, it's going down somewhere. So when you flip the motherboard around, somewhere over here, we've got fuse 2 there. When we measure fuse 2, fuse 2 is dead. There's no response. So I'm gonna use a jumper wire there and uh, get back fuse 2. my jumper wire, I don't know how to it's there. So my soldering iron was off, so it's gonna need a few minutes to actually heat up. Okay, I'll close the video so that it doesn't get too long. Okay, so my solder iron is hot, hot enough now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna solder the jumper wire. Okay, let me prepare jumper wire. Okay, now 
we can check if we have continuity of our life. So now we're good. Okay, let's go to the other city properly. And then we can test it out. So I don't trust to use the customer screen cable anymore because it's really damaged on the OCD key. And there we go. And it's fixed. So it was only the fuse, not the much. And the laptop can be returned to the customer, and it will work just fine. So now I'll give it to one of the guys here to change the screen cable because this one it's really really bad. Let me pull it out and just see. So you can you can see it's like someone was chewing it. It's even got like some points where it's bended. So I'm sure those points they create short circuits inside. So it has to be changed. Anyways, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy. Cheers.